Today we're going to be making a desktop Bitcoin price ticker using an ESP32 development board and an OLED display. This one has been programmed to display the current Bitcoin price in US dollars, but you could set it up to display any cryptocurrency or even multiple ones in any currency, as long as there's an API available for it on one of the exchanges. Along with the price, it also displays the percentage change from yesterday's closing price. It also lights up either a red or green LED underneath the display depending on whether the price has increased or decreased. The ticker is powered by an ESP32 development board which has built-in Wi-Fi. It connects to a Wi-Fi network and then fetches the updated Bitcoin price through the Coindesk API every 15 minutes. To build one of these, you'll need an ESP32 development board, an I2C OLED display, a green and red LED, and two resistors. I'll put links to the parts I've used in the video description. As with most of my projects, I started out by assembling the components on a breadboard to test the connections and the code. My breadboard isn't big enough to access the pins on both sides of the ESP32, so I just tested the OLED display, as the LEDs are quite straightforward to connect and program. I then uploaded the code and the ticker came to life. I designed a PCB to mount the components onto. PCBs are a great way to neaten up your projects and make them a lot more durable. I always add a couple of power connections and some additional I.O. access holes to my PCBs, in case I want to add something later. PCB Way then provided the PCBs for this project for me to share with you. They offer quick turnaround times and are really affordable, with basic PCBs like these from just $5 for 10 pieces, and they're made up in just a day or two. I'll put a link to them in the video description. You can use their online quote tool to get an instant price for your PCBs. I ordered these in black as the PCB is going to be visible in the final design. As you can see, they're really good quality boards and they're well finished off. Let's get our components mounted onto the PCB. Next I designed a cover plate to protect the PCB. This one just protects the PCB from accidental bumps and to prevent a short circuit if anything comes into contact with the pins. I also added a Bitcoin logo onto the cover. I designed a couple of other cryptocurrency options to play around with as well. The cover is mounted onto the PCB using some M3 brass standoffs and some button head screws. I then made some changes to the code to display the Bitcoin logo on startup, and I also put the ESP32 to sleep for 15 minutes between updates to save power. I uploaded the final version of the code and it was then complete. I'll put a link to a full write-up in the video description if you'd like to build your own. Let me know what you think of it in the comment section. Thanks for watching, please remember to like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe for more tech and electronics projects, tutorials and reviews.